Hi, my name is Kaylin Gibbons. Uh, I'm originally from Clarissa, Alberta, and then came over to Boise when I was 19. I did my Bachelor of Science in Mechanical Engineering here at Boise State. And then I stuck around and also did a Master of Science in Mechanical Engineering. And now I am a PhD candidate in computing. So I actually didn't know what I wanted to major in when I got here at Boise State. Um, I was working at the hospital at that time. So when I initially came in, I was saying that I was gonna be a physician's assistant. When I was just starting out to become a learning assistant, it was this really transitionary period in my life where I had still been working, and it was really a jumping off point where I was deciding that I wanted to invest full time in school, abandon working outside of school. And so that was kind of when I had found the learning assistant program. Becoming a learning assistant and being able to work with other students going through those same struggles and being able to really integrate that uh, content into my life and my job allowed me to excel at my own engineering degree progress also. So I still wasn't sure exactly what degree I wanted to do and then I just got around all these really interesting people and we got to talk about really complicated technical stuff all the time and taking those physics classes and learning about those equations and how the world worked, I just knew at that point that engineering was for me. So if you're like me where you didn't know exactly what you were getting into, there's just so many resources here to help you figure that out. And you're going to have that aha moment where you find a professor that you click with really well, or you find some course content that just is really engaging for you and you can see why it's important. At that point, I guarantee that you're going to figure it out and you'll know what you want to do and then we have the ways for you to be able to pursue those opportunities and there's people here that can help you with that.